I want to share a story of how amazing God is. Last Saturday, as I was heading out camping, locking my front door, I did something I don't normally do. I looked towards the end of the hallway, saw that the latch on the escape window was unlocked, and locked it before heading out. That night while camping, after my friend had already gone to bed, I decided to walk down to the lake in order to take a look at the stars up in the sky, as they were spectacular. As I sat at a picnic bench staring up at the stars in the sky, I felt compelled to open up my Bible in one year app on my phone and listen to the reading of the day. The session called Invisible but Invaluable had Bible passages and commentary surrounded around the issue of intercession. After I had finished listening to the Bible in One Year session, I then felt prompted by God to enter into an extended period of prayer for intercession both for others and for myself. Towards the end of the prayer session, I felt compelled once again to start praying for my own protection as well as the protection of my family. I found it a little odd because I felt amazing, I didn't think I was in any danger, so I just went with it and in earnest I prayed for my protection, my whole family, that no evil should befall us. After I'd finished praying, I played the song Gyra by Elevation Music, looked up at the stars and just praised God for the next 10 minutes. I then went back to my campsite, crawled into my sleeping bag and I think it was around 2 a.m. I had a really good sleep that night and I had a safe trip home. Not too long after I got home, there was a knock at my door, which doesn't happen often, and it was my neighbor from across the hallway. She asked me whether or not I had heard all the commotion that morning. What commotion, I asked. I had been camping. At approximately 5.30 a.m. that morning, a burglar on the run from the police tried to break his way into the second floor of our building. And when unable to do so, he fell and injured his ankle and then tried to climb through the bathroom window of my neighbor who lives across the hallway. She called 911 and thankfully the police were already outside our building but it turned into a bit of a standoff uh, until they could reach the injured burglar. I then explained to my neighbor how right before leaving for camping, I locked the window at the end of the hallway. And then four hours before everything went down that morning, I had been praying to God for his intercession for protection. Oddly, she then started praising me as protecting the building. And I made it crystal clear to her right away that this was God's work because to God be the glory.